everyone and welcome back to the green family where iris is still in love with our cow plant which is a great thing because apparently she got nommed by said cow plant oh there go where'd it go oh, there it is <laughs> but apparently she managed to get herself chewed on by the cow plant and it got a little bit of her playful spirit imbued into it as a result and don't mind tate he's just you know back here running around ah oh, come on come on there we go whipping that giant knife around that is just so alarming to me when he just like pulls that knife out and it's just like chop, 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 chop. but yeah iris is doing great she's uh just hanging out with the cow plant i'm glad for that the kids are all off at school which is great and a wonderful little zoe is currently at work also look at these look at these cute little strawberries aren't they just the most adorable little things oh i love them i love them i love them oh my gosh in fact i kind of oh that's right i already did do it I wanted to get some strawberries moved over here. I think we might try like clipping them and like doing some cuttings over there too to see what we can mix with them. But yes, yeah, so I was thinking Iris has been sitting here so close to completing five masterpieces. So I thought today we're gonna have her focus on sitting over here and maybe getting a masterpiece painting done. She's feeling a little bit drained from that fact that she got the cow plant to eat her. So otherwise she's in a great mood though. So we're gonna try to keep her in a really good mood and get her to finish painting another masterpiece. And Tate, uh, oh, Tate has just finished a little woodworking piece. So let's check out what's in here. Somewhere buried in his inventory. <gasps> Look at that little dragon sculpture. Oh, that's so cute. You know who needs that? Ash. Ash needs that. Let's put it back in his inventory for just a second. And we're gonna put that up in Ash's bedroom. I mean, look, that's perfect. And I was thinking Ash would probably really be into uh, collecting like all of the My Sims trophies and having his own My Sims trophy collection. So we're gonna try to help Ash like gather up all the My Sims so he can have his own My Sims. All the spare ones can go to him. And with Get to Work coming out soon, maybe there can be someone who sells like My Sims trophies. Wouldn't that just be so cool? Like a little trophy shop with like little comic books and everything. Maybe someone will do Sims 3 to Sims 4 conversions of the comic book shop. That would be so awesome. Oh my gosh, I would love that if kids could get like more comic books. That would be so cool. And meanwhile, Lily is like destroying the hard work that all of her exercising has done by eating some cake. But you know what? She's had to like work nonstop at exercising for so long now. I'm not, I'm not gonna judge her for it. You go for that cake, Lily. How many days? Yeah, she's got a few more days before work, so we're gonna try to get that fitness skill done. I'm gonna let her like hang out with her brother and eat cake, because she hasn't really had a chance to do that for a long time. All right, and then Lily, what does she need to work on? Oh, she needs to go on more adventures. So today, today we might have Lily go on lots of adventures to work on her little nerd brain. And I am gonna keep my eyes peeled because Pine, I really want Pine to like meet a friend, maybe have a new girlfriend. I, and a lot of people have been, oh, Carolina, this is Carolina. She is the Pancake's daughter. So I added in a lot of new kids and a lot of new, um, new Sims and we should see a ton of them start showing up. I don't know who this is, Margarita. Oh, she's pretty. She's a young adult though. But yeah, a lot of people have been like, Pine should be into guys. And I thought about it really hard. I just don't get that vibe from Pine like I did from Lily. Oh my gosh, school's already out for the day. Well, we'll keep an eye out for teenagers. I guess everybody's gonna have to do their homework. Nope, where are you going, Iris? You gotta do your masterpiece. Did you paint your masterpiece? She really loves the cow plant. Uh, sell the collector. Come on, Iris. Hey, Pine. He's home. He wants to finish his homework. You're not getting a pool. He wants to chat with someone and plant something. That's so cute. He wants to be like his dad. Oh, finish reading three books. Achieve level three logic skill. Um, let's see. Let's have him work on... When did you get... Oh, yeah. He picked onions for his dad. Let's have him do his homework. Let's let your little sister... I'm going to let everyone disperse, and then we'll see who we have to micromanage. Oh, and I forgot that Aaliyah, and a lot of you guys have missed that we did tour Aaliyah's room. So let me pop up here. Oh, look at this. This is awesome. I hope, oh, oh, oh. We're missing an alien. We're missing an alien. Escaped alien. Not good. Two escaped, nope, just one. One escaped alien. I think we have one escaped alien. Okay. Oh, thank goodness. It's just right here. 
Oh, game, don't scare me like that. Move objects on. So it's BB dot move objects on for the cheat, for those of you guys who have been asking. Because you weren't sure like uh, what the cheat is. Hey. hey, you. Scooch up and down. Oh my gosh, it should be moving up and down. It's just being stubborn. There we go. All right, and then I'm going to rotate this little guy. Hold down Alt and line him up with his little rocks. And we're good again. Okay, our alien's back. Whoops, and I'm like ripping the windows off the walls. There we go. But Aaliyah's bedroom, we have two word, but I'm going to come back in here just in case you guys missed it. We have adorable, cute little things. We've got the little statues. We've got the little the little ladybug. She's got her little guppy, a really cute little guppy, and her, her little um, fish tank. This is where she comes up to do her homework, so I'm going to put her homework up here. And she's got her nice little flowers, a beautiful rice lantern uh, right over here. Lots of room for future like toys and presents and things. She has a ton of dinosaurs too, though it looks like some of her, her cousins have run off with her dinos. Yeah, there we go. She's got some dinos that are hiding in here. There we go. So I'm going to take them back out. And then uh, she just painted this actually at the library with her cousin Pine when she went to the library with him. So I'm going to have her put it in there. And she's doing pretty good. She wants to eat cake, so I'm going to let her go ahead and eat some cake. Oh my gosh, these kids. And Ash, he's already grabbing a servant of food too, so everyone's coming in to just like hang out. Oh, look at that. Pine's eating that delicious fruit cobbler. All right, and Lily is kind of tired, but I'm going to have her head off into space or do an upgrade. Let's see. Oh, wow, there's a lot of new upgrades we can install. Hmm, expand cargo bay, install iron de cannon defense system. And the more upgrades... Bring more valuable cargo back to Earth. Oh my gosh. Um, oh man, Lily, I really want you to do that, but we'll just send her out to like normally explore space for now. Oh, and Iris. Iris, sweetie, you need to paint a masterpiece, sweetie. <laughs> Another confident painting, perhaps? Uh, oh, actually, let's get Iris a cup of tea. Ash, Ash, it's okay. Buddy, he's really tense. Why is he tense? Oh, he hasn't been active enough. Okay, well, we'll have Ash take care of that after he gets a little bit of food. He needs to go outside and run around. That's what he needs. And to change Iris's mood, every time I see the alert, I have been meaning, and we can get rid of this now that the lighting is better. So one of the patches really improved the lighting, which I love. We, I have been meaning, meaning, meaning to get the Magic Tea Brewer. Oh, look at that cute outdoor trash can. Oh my gosh, it's adorable. I love it. Can it replace like this trash can? Are we allowed to do that? Like this? Oh, that's awesome. That is just awesome. Let's get this bluish one. Oh, I'm in love. It's just so cute. If I had my choice of trash cans, I would want this. No, no offense, Microbite. Microbite, no offense, no offense. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's see. Um, appliances. It's going to be a kitchen appliance, I think. Magic tea brewer. The ma tea magic. What is this? Oh, the cupcake factory. We haven't used it yet because I, I just haven't had the opportunity. But this is the tea magic personal brewer. Brew all your favorite teas at the touch of a button. Includes handy features like a program timer, programmable timer, cup and pot settings, lemon twist, and a spoonful of sugar option. That's adorable. Also, we need we need more greenery in here. What is this? I need more like plants, please. More plants, more plants. Ooh, ooh. That actually looks pretty good in here. Hey, hey. Oh, stubborn. Hey, stop snapping to my, my grids. Ugh. It's very, very frustrating when like the counter options. Okay, when I send more greenery, this is not, I don't plan on leaving it like this, don't worry. Oh my gosh. Can I for real not, oh, thank goodness, finally. I'm free. I'm free to place this plant wherever I want and I want this plant right there. And the rest of them. <laughs> Sometimes to fill the slots on the counters and other surfaces, you have to do really weird looking things. Don't judge. <laughs> um, I wish we could like put Tate's flowers and things into a small 
little pot. That's one of the things I really wish we could have the option to do. Oh, this is cute. Hmm, it doesn't really fit though. Ooh, ooh, that's pretty. Yeah, let's put that at the back in a green pot to match the rest of the kitchen. Yeah, look at that, that's so pretty. And then we could maybe do like a normal decoration piece, like a kitchen deco piece or some clutter. <gasps> the garden signs, I forgot I downloaded these. So these are actually adorable little signs that an amazing simmer, Do you, did you leave your name in here? Yeah, so there you go guys. If you want these, you can get them from AJ O Y A slash sims dot tumblr dot com. So a joy sims, a joya sims at tumblr dot com. And it actually has like all the little things. It's so cute. Look, it has a little mushroom. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. I need like a proper mushroom garden. I really do. I love mushrooms. Where should we? We should probably move our little mushroom garden. I think that she's also working on making, um, New oh asparagus. What is asparagus one of the things we can grow for real? For real? You we can grow asparagus? Oh my gosh, I had no idea. I had no idea. That's very exciting. Alright, let's finish decorating the kitchen. I have a feeling that Iris, who is the one who makes all the money for us right now anyway, would like the kitchen to be a little bit more more decorated. So we'll go ahead and spend a bit more money on that. There we go. Or maybe we'll put this one up there because it's out of the way. <gasps> a cookie jar! That's the perfect thing to add up there next to the little donut sign. I love it. And you know what? Can we get a nicer sink? I haven't even thought about these kinds of little details for in the kitchen, but can we get like a nice kitchen sink? Sell for $4. Oh my gosh. I think that thing has like broken a million times. Raw industrial sink. No, no, no. I just want like a really nice counter sink because Iris deserves it. Um... Now I want nicer counters. This is the dangerous avenue that stepping into build mode can suddenly give you. Last resort sink. Um, what does this one look like? Ooh, that's um actually not very pretty. What? I like this one a lot better because it's like a little fancier. All right, let's do this color. Yeah, and eventually we'll change the counters. But for now, we need to let the kids play and relax and just be kids. All right, everybody, settle in. Have fun. Microbite, you're gonna get lots of food, apparently. All right, Tate, what are we gonna do with you? He's cleaning the toilets. What a good boy. Cousins are hanging out. Microbite's getting fed. Iris. Oh, Iris! Oh, she's interacting with her kids! Isn't that adorable? Here, you come over here and let's share creative ideas with little Holly. And Brighten Day. And Express Love. I love how they can just do so many different things. Um, Oh, lost in a nebula. Lily's instruments go haywire, and her rocket ship is bathed in purple light. Purple and gold dust coats the sky as far as the eye can see, which isn't very, that far. She must have drifted into a giant nebula. She can send out a call for help or forge ahead. Uh, let's forge ahead. Let's be bold. Um, lecture about misbehavior? What? Let's ask about school. And then... Let's see. What is... The at least it's a pretty nebula. Uh, Lily wanders through the cloud. The dance of golden purple is almost hypnotic. An exquisite dream or luxurious grave. She is at peace with the beauty of her lugubrious... Oh my gosh, that's a new word! Lugubrious fate when suddenly the ship breaks through into clear sky. She's free. All she needs is more luck. She's got to get home on fumes. All right, that's fine. Let's ask the cloud gaze. You know what, Iris? Spend a little time with your daughter. How are the relationship between she and Holly are really close because Holly is very much a mama's girl wants to spend lots of time with mom uh, oh hey there's kids out here it's Philip Burkett and Kevin oh my gosh so we have a million children oh my gosh we have a million children out right now but no teenagers however I have heard that the teenagers will start coming out in force at the park. So we might have to just drag Tate or, or Pine, I mean. Oh my gosh, see, all of the kids are out. All of the millions of children that didn't exist. Oh my gosh, they're just laying in the middle of the sidewalk. You two are such geese. 
Such geese. All right. Then these two are talking. Is Pine just like dutifully doing his homework somewhere? Yep. Up in Nalia's room. That's not weird. Maybe, well, it's really relaxing in Nalia's room. So maybe it's like a nice little office for him just to chill in. And Microbyte's getting fed. Microbyte could actually like fund the uh, the entire kitchen renovations himself. Oh, and Ash like wants to go to sleep right this second. He is such like a night owl. Oh, who's asleep? What? <laughs> oh, Mia! <laughs> yeah, she's just like passed out in her cousin's room. That's fine. All right, Tate. We're gonna have him work on his handiness skill some more. Um, craft furniture. He can do a lot of things. A wall hanging, huh? I wonder what that looks like. We'll have him work on that. I really think it'll be fun to try to set up a farmer's market for him to run. I don't know how that would work, but um, like in Sims 2, Paladin's Palace converted an object, or made an object that would take like uh, a dozen of your crops and put them into a crate. So you could sell crops by the dozen instead of one at a time. And it would be amazing if that happened again. Oh my gosh, Pine. He is such a good student. Look at him. He is like exhausted and hungry. But he did his homework first. Oh, I'm so proud of him. So proud. That was his high school homework, too. I, I wouldn't make him get a job on top of all this. That would just be Nutter Butters. All right. And Iris is done hanging out with Holly. Holly, you know what you've got to do? Your homework. Off you go. Because <laughs> she's still awake. And I don't know if she would want to keep the chef. I think she's willing. Let's give Chef Gino to Ash. So, Because Ash is going to try to get a whole collection Oh, speaking of collections, Tate, is it true? Is it true you can get asparagus, Tate? <gasps> Pretty sure that's an asparagus. It's a rare item. We have all of the things from, from, um, <gasps> I wonder if new plants will come with the new expansion. I would be so happy. I didn't realize we have, like, so far to go on finding more of these items. I had no idea. My gosh, Tate, I thought you were like a complete gardener, but we don't have a complete garden just yet. I still would love to learn the cheat to edit like the world area over here so we could add some more things and take could like donate some plants. Putting just one insect spawner from outdoor retreat wouldn't be bad either, in my opinion. Like I would put it probably over here, closer to where the water worry is, but it would be nice to catch some insects without having to go all the way to uh to Granite Falls to do it. I don't know about you guys, but ants and um termites show up here for me. What you eating, Pine? Cake, everyone's eating cake, and then he's cleaning up. Oh, I love how the kitchen is starting to have more detail. Oh, and Tate's already done. Household inventory, huh? So what does a wooden wall hanging look like? Oh, it's just like a little cutesy thing. Oh my gosh. That so is like something that he would give to his wife, a little wifey present. Oh, let's just put it right there for now. All right, Tate. I wonder if there's like different types of wall hangings. We're gonna find out because I'm gonna make Tate make another one. He's so proud of himself. Uh, craft furniture. Let's do another wall hanging. Oh, Iris. <gasps> she's going to craft. She, she's inspired to paint this all by herself. Maybe this is what we needed. Ooh, this is pretty. Lily, are you all right? Don't you have a bathroom in that ship? Okay, so she's on her way home. All right, Pine's sleeping. Holly's doing her homework. Aaliyah, Aaliyah. No, 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 he's sleeping. That's so cute, she wants to hug her cousin. She's like, you took me to the library. Thank you so much. Do your homework. Holly's hungry. She could probably use a fresh set of dinner. Ah, oh, Don, you made me think you were a teenager and I got all excited. Young adult. Holly's homework is complete. Oh yay, Lily's home! Young young adult? Teen? Ah, oh, yeah, we're gonna send Pine to the park. Pa possibly on Saturday, like send him by himself to the park so that he can just have a good day. Lily's happy! Let's let her use the bathroom and go to sleep. No, 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 use the bathroom first, Lily, and then go to sleep. She didn't bring anything home, but she did go off to space again. So we just need to send her on three more missions to complete that aspiration. And I think Iris is making that painting. We just couldn't force her into it. 
We had to leave her alone so that she could come over here when masterpiece inspiration struck. And I really need the kids to stop eating so much cake. I need Tate to come in here and make like some healthy meals. My gosh. All right, go Iris. Large abstract painting. I hope it's a masterpiece. It's looking really good. Ellie, are you doing your homework? She sure is. What a good kid. What a good kid. What does she need to do? Three games of chess. Read with an adult for two hours. I think Zoe will be able to... Oh my goodness, look! It is a masterpiece! Aspiration completed. Good art is subjective, but spectacular art is universally recognizable. Iris has reached the pinnacle of achieving her dream of becoming a world-class painter. Trey earned expressionistic. Iris can make more can make emotional art regardless of her mood. Iris, congratulations! Oh my gosh, and she's just thinking about all the money that this could bring in. Well, let's go ahead and we're gonna sell some of her old paintings. Um like this one right here, because uh, that one I have never really enjoyed very much, and I think that's the only one that I wasn't really a huge fan of. Like this one's kind of cute, um, but I'm going to sell it and replace it with this one, because this one's awesome. And then we can do the thing where now we put a little frame on it, and oh, no, no, no put frame on and then we're gonna name it and we're gonna name it uh, the fulfilling masterpiece yay Iris yay what new what new aspiration should we pick for her she wants to go eat some cake to celebrate that's adorable all right time to select a new aspiration for Iris best-selling author maybe food master chef um, she is very creative. She's very family oriented. Um, she's very love oriented soulmate. I think I think we, she would want to fulfill the soulmate one. So let's try that because she's very flirty. Ooh, and now it's time to go on two dates with her husband. I like that. So that's what we're going to do for Iris. She has now fulfilled her mega want and she is ready to focus on more romantic adventures so that's very exciting congratulations iris okay ash don't get too close to your dad while he's like smashing things <laughs> oh my goodness and is she painting something else and she's just uh oh i took the painting away from her too early so she's just dabbling on the on the easel there but all right so we are going to uh yeah she's so proud of herself she's so proud we're gonna let her go eat her cake to celebrate and I will see you guys next time when we will have to continue working with the family. Let's see what Tate just made. Another little wall hanging. Awesome. He's actually, like, the woodworking skill is apparently using some of his, uh, his traits. So, yeah. Yeah. I like that. All right. So, current goals are to try to help Pine find, like, a girlfriend or just some really close companion. Apparently, we can't even find other teenagers right now. And we're going to get Lily up on her nerd brain skill. And we're going to try to get Zoe promoted. So I will see you guys next time. And we'll have to see. I want to fill this room up with aliens. That would be so cool. Maybe we'll have to get both girls rocket ships to like just go out. And with like get to work, you can sell anything. Imagine having a little alien pet shop. That would be so cool. I want to have an alien pet shop. That would be awesome. Oh my gosh. But all right, guys. Here's all of our little blinky aliens, and I will see you guys next time.